The Beaver Dam Middle School robotics team is heading to Japan for an international competition, one of just eight American teams. And not only are the students designing some pretty cool robots, they're also making a difference in their community. Amanda Quintana reports. These are the Mega Minds, one of two Wisconsin robotics teams participating in the first Lego League's international competition. Should be up here, but it's not. The middle school has made it to state competitions in the past, but this is the first global competition for Beaver Dam. I didn't ever think that we were going to go to Japan, which is pretty crazy to think about for me because I never thought we were going to make it this far. The competition will host teams from 60 countries worldwide. Team coach Brian Lerwick says it's a great feeling to see them qualify, but what the team has already accomplished here at home could be even more impressive. It's very rewarding for us as coaches, but also I mean, it's great to see the enthusiasm of the kids when you know, they, they made it, they, they did well. The competition isn't just about building robots. Teams are also tasked with finding and solving a community problem to present at the competition. We talked to our mayor and we found out that vacant buildings are a big problem in Beaver Dam. They have a lot of environmental issues and safety issues. Um, and we actually have 29 vacant buildings in Beaver Dam. The middle schooler's solution, a family and teen entertainment center, which caught the attention of a local investor. We didn't think uh, that it would become a reality because most projects that are presented in um, FLL competitions, they don't become a reality. It's just a hypothetical situation. Um, but this year we're really excited because we get to give back to our community. Win or lose, the impact they're making at home is something they can be proud of. Well, coaches have started a GoFundMe as well mm -hmm. to help all nine team members pay their way to the competition. And they hope to raise more than $2,000 for each student, including flights and passports for, again, every student.